Hello guys from Fairwick Town. Today I'm going to talk about the match between Novak Djokovic and Christian Gary at uh, Garin at Astana 2022. So the round of 16 match. I mean, uh, great performance by the Serb as he defeats in convincing fashion the uh, Chilean Christian Garin 6-1, 6-1. I mean, what a complete domination. Uh, what a match. Um, Djokovic is surely in red, uh, hot form, in top form. I mean, he's playing very well lately. Um, of course, after winning in Tel Aviv on Sunday in where he secured his 89 tour-level title without dropping a set. And in, the, in that tournament, he defeated the Croatian Marin Cilic. And um, coming back to the match with Christian Green, uh, Djokovic was able to find his consistency in his shot and his accur accuracy and... Uh, I mean, he's playing very well. We can see that he's very hungry. He missed a lot of competition uh, this year. He's eager to win another title. I think he has a big chance now in winning in Kazakhstan. The only threat maybe could be Medvedev, but I don't see anyone stopping him at the moment. And um, I mean, uh, Djokovic still has a chance to qualify for this year's ATP finals in Turin. I think he needs a lot of points uh, in, in, the, in the next week to, uh, to try to qualify for that important event. We know that Djokovic considers that event very important. He won it uh, five times, the ATP World Tour Finals. It's just one title uh, from Roger Federer. And Djokovic, uh, I mean, when he plays like that, he's really unstoppable. You cannot find uh, any answers uh, to stop him. I mean, it's already a good start from him. Uh, his next opponent will be Botic van de Sanskulp. I don't think it's going to be a very tough test. Maybe it's going to be... I don't think it's going to be a more difficult match. It depends uh, how it is the game of uh, Botic van de Sanskulp. But it was already uh, the third time that Djokovic was facing Christian Garin. He leads, of course, this head-to-head three love in his favor and there is not much that Christian Green could do. I mean, uh, when Djokovic is playing like that, uh, well, you're uh, a bit lost on the court. So you don't know what to do. And uh, uh, Djokovic demonstrated a lot of times why he's one of the greatest players of all time, maybe the greatest player to ever pick up a racket. I think uh, Djokovic has the all round game. He's very uh, complete and, uh, I mean, uh, 21 Grand Slams. I hope he's going to play this year in Australia. We'll see what will happen. But uh, I think Djokovic has, this conf has, the, the, has the confidence to win a lot of titles uh, this year. Guys, that's it for today. Thank you very much for listening. And as always, if you like the channel, don't hesitate to subscribe. And most importantly, don't forget to leave a like on, the on this video. And see you next time. Bye.